welcome here. You're not welcome anywhere. Now get the fuck out of my bar. Just give me one more drink and then I'll leave. You did, poor I mean it. I'm gonna need you to come with me right now. Look, lady, I'm not interested. All right, well, I'm sort of on the tick tick, so upsy daisy. Oh, whiskey dick of the claws. It's quite common in Wolverines over 40. You don't want this. Unless you want to take a deep breath through your fucking forehead, I suggest you reconsider. I'm about to lose everything that I've ever cared about. Not my fucking problem. Is that what you said when your world went to shit? Come again. This Wolverine let down his entire world. Want to talk about what's haunting you, or should we wait for a third act flashback? Uh, go fuck yourself. <laughs> Okay, I like where they're going with this. Now, I see that this Wolverine is like a variant from a different, uh, a different uh, world. So, uh, and and you know that's the only bad thing that I don't like about the whole, um, you know, multiverse is that these are all different Wolverines. So it's not the Wolverine from Logan, and it's not the Wolverine from you know from the X Men Days of Future Past and those things and those natures. So, but it, it's still the original. Uh, you know, them bringing back the yellow suit. I do love that aspect of it. It's just interesting to see like where exactly in the timeline this X Men or this uh, variant Wolverine come from, and the seeds like this one. I, like I said, I am not a comic book ever become book reader so it would probably be more better if i was that way i would know kind of the timeline or the actual um wolverine that we're getting in this one so and also kind of where does this start it, it, I think a lot of this is going to take place after, obviously after Deadpool 2, but a lot of this with the uh, CBA, you know, kind of with the, uh, with Loki, you know, is going to be kind of like the time travel uh, association thing that they're, they're going to be involved in this one. So I really need to go back and finish. I didn't finish Loki season two. I finished Loki season one, but I need to go back and see that. But I'm excited. This is going to be the only Marvel release this year. So, uh, you know, they've been, you know, bombarding us with these movies and they starting to lose a lot of, of, of traction. So, but I think, you know, bringing back Hugh Jackson, Hugh Jackson, Hugh Jackson, excuse me, is going to be a huge success. And I think this Deadpool is going to break records. I think this is going to be one of the highest grossing radar movies of the summer, if not the year or in total. So it's super excited. Can't wait to see it. What do you guys think?